Hi guys, I'm Adrian and today I would like to teach you how to connect your mobile phone with HiCam IP Pro DVR. So for Android user, you have to go to Google Play Store and for iPhone user, you have to go to iPhone App Store. So let's proceed with the Google Play Store and we have to search for the app. The name of the app is IP Pro, IPC Pro. Then search. So the first app is the app which we are looking for and please proceed with install So the app is downloading it will take a couple minutes until the download is done While waiting for that we go through some basic functions and the face of the app So basically these are the interface of the app so we can have a look on this and you have some rating from the user which they have try out this app okay 53 percent we're taking you to the main screen so as soon as the download is finished, the app should be put up somewhere over here. Okay, the app is finished with the installation. Okay, so this is the app which we have installed. Its name is IP Pro. Then just open it up. Okay, you can register an account with your email. If you don't want, you can just press it with trial. Okay, so this is these are the basic interface. So I will now teach you how to add the device into this IP Pro. To add the device, please select the plus button. Okay, so we select the first one, eight device by ID. So I will insert my ID. So please insert your ID as well of your DVR. 445790. So I will just name my device as my office. You can name your device for like my restaurant, my home, my house, yeah. And then the username and password of my DVR is admin admin. So and then I have uh, 8 channels of DVR so I will change the number of channels to 8 and then submit mm -hmm. so there you go this is the device which we have added you can just press into it so this is the live view of the device which I have added just now and then you can slide through to see the next 4 speed screen channel and slide it back channel number 1 until channel number 4 Besides, we can change the number of speed screen and for single speed screen, you can slide it through Okay, and then we have a zoom in function zoom out and we can change the stream of the video as well SD for smooth the video it's smooth the right Okay, for HD for clear video so you can see everything is turned killer then we change it back to SD besides we can capture the live view image snapshot success and we can record video for this channel so it's recording you can stop the record okay besides we also can play back this one So this is the interface of the playback. So you have date and channels. So we can select the date. Let's say we repair a playback for 24th April. And then we select channel number 3. So it's playing back over here, right? So you can zoom in, zoom out. So you can drag the time frame to change the time.
Yep, so the time has changed. So it's 2, 2 14 at the morning, early morning. Okay, you can zoom in, zoom out, capture the photo, snapshot success. You can pause it and play, and you can record the playback into your mobile phone and stop record. And then, yeah, that's all for the playback. And you go back and go back to the main interface, and you have to go to the third menu for me. And for local record, which we have record just now, the snapshot, do you still remember? So this is the snapshot which we have captured just now. And for the video, this other video, which we have captured. Yeah, so I think that's all for today. And thank you for watching and have a nice day guys.